All right, so what's going on YouTube? I just wanted to do a uh, final video here of my 300X. I've been through probably 10 different setups and um, looking for the best setup for the 300 CFX. Um, this is basically what I've come up with. Um, I went with this Scorpion uh, 2213-14 motor. Um, and the Castle Talon 35, um, just changing those out alone I think only adds 3 grams, so that's definitely an uh, awesome, uh, upgrade. As far as the servos, um, the Cyclic, I went, uh, the TGY 211 DMHs, um, they're 16 gram servos, I had the 21 grams on there. And I'm trying to cut back on the weight, trying to figure out the the best best setup for it, and this is what I've come up with. Um, I went to MKS DS95 on the tail. Yeah, it's 21 gram, but um, the performance of it, you can't match that. Um, I also have uh, the 306G, Turnigy 306G HV that I'm using on my 450X. Um, that I'm using on the tail of that, I got that on all four of those actually, running them at 8.4 volts. That thing works awesome too. It's very comparable to this. Um, but I went with the Metalhead DFC. It's got the DFC main shaft. Um, it's 5 millimeters shorter. Uh, metal swash. Uh, I came back, back in the tail here with the 450, T-Rex 450 tail hub and grip set that is a must do to any normal 300 and I went with the uh, aluminum uh, pitch arm here the stock plastic one I don't know if you could see it down here um, started bending up and was touching the tail case I guess from putting on and taking off the rod so many times so going with that metal was a good idea um, the Lynx slant gear and 14 tooth slant pinion um, I'm not running the governor on this one. I didn't like how that was. I could probably turn up the gain and mess with it and figure it out, but it's good. Uh, no governor, just, uh, fixed endpoints. Uh, 14 tooth pinion. I think I'm somewhere in the 3600 RPM range. Um, works really well. I went with the, uh, the Lynx hub in there. It's supposed to be, uh, one-way bearing, but it, it doesn't work as you would think it would. Yeah, it turns, but it doesn't, like, you know, it just kind of stops abruptly. No different than just the gear. Um, but, yeah, so that's the final setup. Um, I actually canceled my pre-order of the CFX. I'm just going to order the frame because um, I just got the 550X. So I'm trying to cut back on the money or whatever. But uh, as soon as the CFX frames come out, I'll put this on there. But uh, yeah, here's the final flight video, and uh, enjoy. All right. <laughs> 